Yo, what's happening guys? Coming to you from the Las Vegas warehouse here at Down for Sound. I uh, wanted to go over with you today, fans. It's very important, especially here in Vegas, but anywhere where you have some extreme temperatures or even warm temperatures, because your amplifiers, they're just gonna grow off of that temperature. So um, here in Vegas, we experience some of the most extreme temperatures in the United States, I would say. So fans are important. Some uh, amplifiers have built-in fans, but some do not. So if yours doesn't, you definitely need to get a fan to help cool yours off. But if yours does, it doesn't hurt to have another one just as a backup. So we carry uh, two different fans here at Down for Sound. And they range, I think, somewhere from 40 to 50 bucks, something like that. But this could definitely protect your investment. So this one is a smaller, they call these uh, like bilge fans. Uh, they use them in boating a lot, but uh, these move a ton of air. They are kind of noisy, but they move a ton of air. So if you're looking something for something that's going to cool your amplifiers off, be sure to check these out. So we have this size. It's a uh, 140 CFM. If you want something, so if you need something small, a little smaller footprint, but obviously it's not going to move quite as much air as this one that is this big brother that moves, uh, I think it's 270, 270 CFM. So you can see the difference right here between these two fans, but whichever one is going to work for you, that's going to be determined by you, but definitely if you're trying to get more longevity out of your amplifiers get you some fans to go on there and help keep them cool in the winter time sorry in the summer time uh because you definitely will benefit a lot by having your fans on there during the summer time so so definitely uh fans are very important and in my personal vehicle the tahoe everybody knows me for neo ho we have fans all throughout there so we have inside the enclosure I have six of these mounted on the wall inside the enclosure so when I get finished demoing I can turn those on and it blows air past the uh, subwoofer magnets and out into the cab and then it like goes out from the cab from there so that helps cool off the subs even faster and then in the back I have them built in incorporated into the trim panels I have multiple fans there to help move a ton of air across the amplifiers in the back to help keep them cooled off and also on the sides of the box I have fans there as well Again, I'm practicing what I preach to you to help you get more longevity out of your system as well. Anyway, check them out on downforsoundshop.com. Be sure to smash that thumbs up button and check out the description if you want to see or have direct links to these so you can check them out on the store and grab yours today. Yo, what's up guys? If you want to see more of the hot content that you just saw in that video, be sure to follow me on all my social media channels from YouTube, Facebook, Instagram, uh, TikTok, The Life of Christ is my handle on there. I also have the Down for Sound Shop on Facebook and Instagram, and don't forget Snapchat is JPD4S. Check out all the hot content on there as well.